Hi guys, bit of fun to it, with Opie Dog, as you can see in the background. Right, as I said before, I do appreciate everybody watching my videos, I do appreciate for you guys who are new, subbed into me, or oh, I shouldn't say me, I should say us. So, yeah, oi, please stop. Oi, no. Right, sorry about that guys, but I'm not, I'm just going to crack on. Right, today I want to talk about my new fishing kit. I've been going through my bag in the last couple of days, as you can see what. Right, so don't be quite there. Yeah, I've been going through that in the last couple of weeks since I've not been very well, and I've been I've been cutting down things. I've been finding out that personally, I've been carrying more than what I actually need, and basically, it doesn't sound right. It doesn't look right. So, yeah. Right, I'm gonna go for this bag now. This pouch. This is my new fishing kit. It's small as you can see. It's not very big. It's not a lot in it compared to before. I've cut. I've cut the waste, I've cut the rubbish out. There is some more stuff what's in the bottom pouch of my rucksack. There, what I'm pointing at. But I'll go through that once I um, go through my rucksack when, when I do a video of the whole of my kit in my rucksack. So, yeah, I've even gone through my belt kit. So, there's so much stuff I've gone through and there's so much changes. So, it's going to be a long, long time. So, this is the 2019 fishing kit and I'll make a hell of a list saying 2019 kit so as you all know on the outside as you can see is a pen mod so yes I think it's three foot this pen mod not very big but it's good it works I like it and so I'm gonna carry on carrying it so yeah. right, I'm gonna find something so I can stick on the outside of this so I know it's my fishing kit because if you know guys, I do have a lot of these little pouches. So yeah, let's begin. As you can see, there's quite a bit still in it, but not as much as before. But I'll show you individually, one by one. We'll start on this side. I have a small net needle this time. I don't have a large one. I do have a large net needle in my inch bag, but I will show you in my inch, I shouldn't say inch bag, my inch compartment or my inch modular side from one of my modular sides of my inch bag, what goes on the on the sides of that bag. So yeah, but we won't go into that now because I'm putting it to three minutes. So I have a small net needle. I have a pair of these. I don't know what they're called, I don't know they're flippers, but I don't know what they're called, so I have a pair of them. I am thinking about building a little sleeve to stick these in so this the shear pieces don't rip up anything else up. So yeah. No, I'll go for that one in a minute because there's a lot of stuff in that one. I do have my hook remover still. I do have my knot tire. I'm not very good when I'm coming to when it comes to really small fishing hook. So I have this one. Help me with it. I have my bait needle and drill. So that's them. I know I have the shears, but I do carry a set of these fishing shears. I don't really use them that often. I don't know if I'm going to be carrying using or carrying them, but I do have a set, so I put them in here. I do have my handle to my fishing wheel, separate to my fishing wheel. It is the small one. I am changing the line on the fishing on the fishing wheel because it's too big, and I would like to go and go get some smaller. So there's that. I'm not putting everything back in because it takes too long. I do have my alarm, bait alarm, not bait alarm, but my fish on alarm. Oh, he lost the battery then. I do have to get another battery, I reckon, sometime, some point, but. If you haven't seen this before, I'll show you quickly. You hook it onto your top of your fishing rod for these little hooks, and then you s and that goes like that, and then it click and it green when it's no fish, but it goes red when there's a fish on. As you can see, there's a red light. So yeah, it's a good little thing. Highly recommend it, and it didn't cost me a lot. So yeah, right. I have cut down my hooks, as you can see, this is all the hooks I carry now. It's a small little case. 
there's not not many there's not that many big hooks because at the end of the day i worked out the other day that my pen rod is going to be too small to catch a really big fish i know you can catch big fish on small hooks but you can't catch small fish on on big hooks so that's the reason why i've cut down my hook section and it cuts down on this was point me looking at the things what to use Right, we have that one there. I'll go for that in a minute. I'll go for this one first. There's my leaders. I do carry some leaders still. So yeah, right. We'll go for the that pouch as well as this tin. But we'll go for the tin first. I'm not going to get everything out. What's all is in what's in here? I'll bring the camera down for you to see. All it is is beads, weights, and swivels in that little tin. So yeah, I'm not gonna. As I said, I'm not, I don't want to go through that because I don't want to take everything out because it will go everywhere. And I'll just go bing and it will <laughs> all over the place. So, yeah. Right. I do carry some fake bait still. It's only a smaller tin. It's a lot smaller and it's not that much in here. So, and I can still always get some fresh bait if I want. These are apparently line floats. I've never tried them. I'm going to try them out this year. How do you put them on your line and how it makes your line float? instead of using floats so we'll give that a go i don't know if that's true and i've cut down my selection of spoons and lures that's the lures i'm carrying now i'm not going to get them out because in the day that would take too long for seven minutes and there's my selection of spoons or spinners or whatever you want to call them i always got told those are called spoons so that's my new 2019 fishing kit. That's what we will be using in the next couple of weeks, hopefully, when I'm better. I did want to do this video outside, so, but never mind. So, tell me what you think. Tell me what you would take away and tell me what you would add. Remember, guys, I'm trying to keep small now. I'm not trying to carry too much. So, we'll see you in the next one, guys. And in the next one, I will be showing you my 2019 fire kit. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye.